Vacuum filtration is a fast and effective way to filter many chemical mixtures. Some materials you will need for a successful filtration include a beaker with a mixture, a stirring rod, rubber policeman, filter paper, and a wash bottle. Always make sure to check that the filter assembly is working correctly before use by turning on the water. To position the filter paper correctly, place the filter paper in the Buchner funnel and wet the paper. Use the same solvent that is in the mixture being filtered. For a high school lab, this is usually water. Start adding the mixture right away before the filter paper dries. Decant about half of the liquid first by pouring it down the stirring rod onto the center of the filter paper. Stir the mixture and then pour the remaining into the funnel. Then use a rubber policeman to transfer the rest of the solid into the Buchner funnel. Transfer any remaining solid by rinsing all materials with the solvent, which in this case was water. Dry the precipitate as desired, then release the vacuum and turn off the water flow. It is important to equalize the reduced pressure of the filtration assembly before turning off the water flow to the aspirator. When correctly using lab filtration, it can save quite a bit of time, both in the filtering and in the sample dry time.